At CERN, the world's largest and most powerful particle accelerator, physicists made a groundbreaking discovery by identifying the elusive ghost that had been haunting the facility. Greetings, everyone. Today, we will delve into an intriguing subject involving the recent findings of scientists at CERN and Goethe University, Frankfurt. Their groundbreaking discovery revolves around a resonant phenomenon, commonly referred to as a ghost, that has a significant impact on the behavior of particles within the superproton synchrotron, SPS. A remarkable feat, considering it is the largest particle accelerator in the world. This ghostly presence arises from the concept of resonance, which manifests as areas where energy becomes intensified, ultimately leading to the degradation of particle beams. To gain a deeper understanding, the researchers employed a Poincaré section, a valuable tool that allowed them to map out the intersections of various elements within the SPS. By doing so, they were able to accurately predict the accumulation points of particles. The implications of this study are far-reaching, as it has the potential to aid researchers in devising effective strategies to mitigate the effects of fixed harmonic lines and prevent the formation of these magnetic ghosts altogether. Without further delay, let us embark on our insightful discussion. A recent study released in the scientific journal Nature Physics disclosed groundbreaking findings from researchers at CERN in Switzerland and Goethe University Frankfurt in Germany. The scientists successfully identified a resonant ghost entity that significantly influences the behavior of particles within the superproton synchrotron, SPS. This elusive phenomenon takes the form of a three-dimensional shape that undergoes continuous transformation necessitating its measurement in the fourth dimension. Remarkably, the underlying principle behind this discovery is akin to the reason why one may accidentally spill their coffee while returning to their desk or witness their friends experiencing heightened bouncing on a trampoline. At CERN, the SPS, a nearly four mile wide ring constructed in the 1970s, has retained its significance. Despite its age, the SPS received an upgraded beam dump in 2019, serving as a safety mechanism for the powerful beams within. Thus, when researchers detected an anomaly, they recognized the need to thoroughly map and comprehend it for future endeavors. This anomaly, often referred to as the ghost in the machine, is a result of resonance. When objects possess energy and generate waves, these waves can interact and form peculiar focal points where energy is intensified. Just like how walking with a cup of coffee causes the liquid to create waves that eventually collide and spill, or how one person's jump on a trampoline can coincide with another's, resulting in a higher leap, the SPS experiences a loss of crucial photons due to this phenomenon, which is known as beam degradation. The scientists elaborate in their paper that a comprehensive understanding of resonances and nonlinear dynamics is imperative in the realm of accelerator physics to prevent the loss of beam particles. The complexity of this understanding amplifies as the problem at hand becomes more intricate, involving additional moving parts and degrees of freedom. Each individual component, including the connectors, contributes to the generation of its own vibrations. The deterioration of the beam poses a significant challenge, particularly as the proton beams become increasingly energetic and robust. Furthermore, harmonic disruptions in intricate systems impact any experiment involving particle interactions within a vessel, such as nuclear fusion research conducted in tokamaks. Consequently, harmonic interference represents a major obstacle in the pursuit of productive nuclear fusion, resulting in dead zones where the flow of energy can dissipate crucial heat energy. Within the SPS, particles possess a limited range of movement which may not initially appear overly intricate. Similar to photons confined within a fiber optic cable, these SPS photons follow a defined trajectory. However, they also have the ability to rebound within this path due to the inherent thickness of even a narrow beam or cable. Although the SPS is not as thick as a donut, it is still a tangible, real-life representation of a donut, rather than a mere circle found in a geometry textbook illustration. The phenomenon of this rebound is distorted by various factors tied to human involvement and the constraints of reality. 
Despite being regarded as one of the world's leading facilities, the SPS, like all scientific endeavours, must work with the resources available. The magnets responsible for powering these facilities are not flawless, and even slight fluctuations in magnetism can induce resonance. To quantify and analyse this effect, the researchers conducted measurements throughout the SPS ring, utilising the collected data to construct a mathematical model known as a Poincaré section. By establishing a fixed line within a Poincaré section, the researchers have the ability to explore the system by identifying all the points of intersection with other elements. This process ultimately generates a complete surface, similar to an MRI scan, but for a system that is constantly evolving. Notably, the addition of time as the fourth dimension adds further complexity to the shape of this dynamic system. Furthermore, due to the repetitive nature of resonance in a closed system like the SPS, the study of the 4D surface can be visualised as a seamless loop, much like a meticulously crafted GIF. Through their mathematical analysis, the team discovered that predetermined lines possess the ability to forecast the accumulation of particles. With a dedicated effort to comprehensively examine and simulate this phenomenon, their aim is to provide valuable assistance to researchers in devising effective methods to mitigate the impact of these fixed harmonic lines. Furthermore, this research has the potential to guide those involved in the construction of novel particle accelerators, enabling them to prevent the emergence of disruptive magnetic anomalies. By doing so, substantial cost savings can be achieved by preserving the integrity of beams and data, ultimately leading to superior outcomes with reduced effort. To support our channel's growth and ensure broader awareness, kindly hit the like and subscribe buttons. This will help us reach more individuals and disseminate valuable information. Thank you in advance.